Street Reach for the Homeless started when I saw those men and women who fall through the cracks that maybe for whatever reason um, have their own concern about a shelter or somewhere of that nature fit not into that program but then find that where their life is going to be what they're going to call home is going to be the streets and to realize that that is what they call home and then to turn my back once I became aware of that walk away and say I'm not going to do something to help make a difference would simply be wrong in my world. Every Monday and Thursday night I am somewhere under the stars 52 weeks a year serving a full dinner and bringing also then all those tangible things that someone might have a need for if they're living in the elements. So it can be everything from tents to tarps to sleeping bags, blankets, comforters. In the winter time, it's your winter coats, it's your gloves, it's your boots, it's always blue jeans, sweatpants, hoodies, things of that sort, the tangible. But then it's also those intangibles. It's being the one that stands there and listens and hears despair sometimes, shares in the joys, celebrates the great victories when someone does get a job and moves themselves off the street. Those are the things that mean almost more than that food, almost more than that tent, that recognizing that person is another human being who wants to share. For Sally was a little bit of a challenge because I've never done a photo shoot for a woman that didn't want a photo shoot. <laughs> but um, she came in and she had her photo shoot and she was absolutely beautiful. And, um, and I think someone somewhere will appreciate those pictures at some point in time. As we all know, I can live without the makeover. I could live without the clothes. But any opportunity to have the awareness and see these people through my eyes, make people aware that we have citizens in this city that do not have a roof over their head, then to have this platform, to have this springboard, to maybe make one set of eyes be more open or one set of ears hear something they hadn't heard before, makes everything in the world worth it. This month, from now until April the 5th, we are doing a blankets and blue jeans drive. Um, there are several locations in Fort Wayne where you can drop things off. Um, the DuPont um, location, Women's Health Advantage, as well as the one on Jefferson, you can bring in gently used blankets or blue jeans for men or women, and you can drop them off there. And all of those things will go directly to Sally, and she provides them for the homeless in Fort Wayne.